Yo, YT is me, CTV, Chris the Vigilante, and yes, Sunday, fun day, leg day. Um, my homegirl, Renita, hit me up and was like, hey, I want to train legs with you. So I said, hey, come on. So um, started, the, started the routine with front squats. Y'all know how much I hate these, but because it is such a good lower ab exercise, yes, I said it, it's a great lower ab exercise. I am going to I think I'm going to alternate between that leg press and the back squats, but my back squats aren't going anywhere. And here's my buddy right here, oh Renita, what's up, homie? But um, yeah, so I'm gonna continue to include the uh, front squats in my routine now. I'm not gonna be front squatting four and five hundred pounds like I do with the back squats, but I mean, you know, you win some, you lose some. You know what I mean? My PR is about, I think, 315 on the front squats for about four or five reps. But this right here was 245. I think this was four reps. I'm not even going to sit here and watch and try to count and try to worry about it. But, yeah, um, <sighs> front squats. I'm sorry, y'all. I just feel some kind of way about these things. But because they give me such tension in my lower abs, I'm going to continue to do them. But anyway, I moved right into leg presses, and I did these... Um, three sets 15 to 20 reps um all the squat kings out there you know really have something against leg presses me i don't i mean i think it's you know if you really have serious serious knee issues and you really you know you can't squat or you paranoid from all the acl tears from athletics and you know whatever i mean leg press is a great alternative i mean you're still building um great size and strength in your quads now if you you know if you're an athlete and you you know you're training for a sport i wouldn't recommend the leg press but you know if you you know old man like me you know you know that had a couple knee issues ain't nothing wrong with the leg press so i went into the hamstring exercise the uh stiff leg stiff leg deadlift and we did that three sets 20 reps um as you can see here i'm not coming all the way up because i told y'all about my um my neck slash trap injury so i'm trying to keep it safe with the deadlifts plus plus this little um what some may refer to as gyrating this motion actually keeps the tension on the hamstring so trolls you know form police you know at the, there's your lesson i just ethered you right there and you didn't even know it so yep did those three sets 20 reps um renita is coming all the way up because you know as far as I know, she doesn't have any um, trap issues or neck issues, so I had her go all the way up, all the way down. But me, if you got any um, trap issues or want to keep that tension on those hamstrings, then um, the way that you saw me doing those is a, is a great way to do it. Then we jumped into the leg extension, my favorite quad exercise, and we did that for four sets, 25 reps. Um, Again, I know the, the motion here is kind of fast. You know, this is, you know, the form is something that you may or may not be used to, but it works for me. Just listen, forget what everybody say. Just just do what works best for you, all right? Always do what works best for you. And then next thing I know, check this out. You won't believe this. Really? Oh really? I'm putting that on camera, by the way. Don't shush me, let's go. Then after all her complaining and whining, we jumped into leg curls and we did this three sets, 15 reps. Um, again, another hamstring exercise. I'm really trying to, you know, strengthen my hamstrings because it's been a neglected body part for, for years with me, just like um, hamstrings, rear delts, and lower abs, all neglected body parts that, you know, now I'm trying to play catch up with. So that was pretty much that Sunday, fun day, leg day. Um, I was gonna do some abs, but you know, the uh, I had I had a few things to do, had a, a couple appointments to be at, and then you know I had already did my front squats. So, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, and reshare. And y'all have a great week. Thanks a lot.